Welcome, heroes, to some more Skyrim. Uh, so last time we left off, we got Ariel's bow. This guy right here. And we also just got a whole bunch of arrows for it, too. So, ooh, this is going to be awesome. So, the thing is, we have the bow, and we have the prophecy. I think there's, like, one more Elder Scroll, but the problem is, we're going to have to confront her father. I'm not looking forward to that. However, prior to that, I believe we'll have some time to maybe offload some junk that I've collected over the course of, you know, fighting stuff. But at the very least, if we do have to fight her father, we got Donavir with us. So that'll be a thing. Oh, and also, I could always come back here for some more arrows. That's always a bonus. Okay, so, I need to find my way out of this cave. Mushrooms, mushrooms, mushrooms. Delicious mushrooms. Where, where was the exit again? <laughs> Anyways, uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut to a little bit later. I'm going to head down to Whiterun, offload some junk. That's pretty much it. And I'll cut to, you know, anything interesting that happens, like usual. So, I'll see you when, um, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, well, <clears throat> that's all my stuff jumped off. I see you're just gonna be sitting there. We gotta confront your father, Serena. We can't be sitting around. Come on, let's go. Uh, you got armor and such. Yeah, we, we should be able to take this. We got Ariel's bow, and I'm a badass so you know that's that's always good uh, I have a ring I just made oh, where is it this ring of the crane I don't know what I was going for when naming it but sure it does plus six damage so I have a ring to help me do more damage and I'm just a general badass so it, this, this shouldn't be too much of a problem right Right, right, yeah, yeah, okay, we'll just, just go in and say hi, you know, father person, yeah, hey, what's that over there? Shoot you in the back of the head. I have a feeling I'm probably going to have to be going up against every vampire in there, though. <sighs> oh. oh, those are the crows. Well, let's just keep this at the ready. <sighs> this place always makes me uneasy. They always send vampires after me. There's so much mistrust. It's just it's not a healthy environment. It's not a healthy environment at all. <sighs> I hope they didn't kill my uh, moth priest. I mean, he may not have as much use to me anymore, but it's still mine. I mean, I could still use him for blood. Okay. It's quiet. Too quiet. Oh. The feast never ends here in Castle Volcar. Yeah, I imagine not. Sit down and enjoy yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll pass. I'll t I'll just I'll take some of this to go. Uh, yeah, this stuff can be used for like mana potions and such. I leave politics any to any blood any more blood potions? Yeah, I'll take those. Ew. <laughs> Oh my, look at all these blood potions. I wish I could make them. That would be awesome. So those things are like insta-heal and then they cure your uh, blood problem as well. Skooma! Yeah, let's go take that. <laughs> uh, why, did, why do vampires have skooma? Can they actually use it? I don't know. Well, I need to go back here, I guess. Uh, I don't know what's back here. The Volokar Cathedral. So, 
You've Ooh. returned. Yep. Is your pet keeping you entertained? You know why we're here. Of course I do. You disappoint me, Serana. Hmm. You've taken everything I provided for you and thrown it all away for this pathetic half-breed vampire. Half-breed? I'm a full Kashyyyk. Thank you very much. You've destroyed our family. You've killed other vampires all over some prophecy that we barely understand. Getting a good vantage no, point. I'm done with you. You will not touch him. So, I see this dragon has fangs. Your mm -hmm. voice drips with the venom of your mother's influence. How it's okay, we got like this. You've become. No. Because unlike her, I'm not afraid of you. Not anymore. And you. We killed bigger people. Hmm? Oh. I guess I gotta talk to him at this point. It appears I have you to thank for turning my daughter against me. I, I knew it was Hey, I try to convince her. Before your ambition outgrew your loyalty. <laughs> loyalty? You never intended to let Zeshin live. A small price to pay for the betterment of our kind. <laughs> you are an insult to your to our kind, Harkin. Oh, come now. Spare me your notions of kinship. You <laughs> simply used Serana in an attempt to take away what should rightfully be mine. Nah. Let's see. Uh, the ball belongs to Zeshin now. Finally, a trace of honesty in our little <laughs> conversation. This is going to be mine. It's my bow. The fate of the vampire in your grasp. Exhilarating, isn't it? Uh. Little patience for talk. Good. Let's end this. Yeah, final boss fight. Whoa! Whoa! Take that! This bow is awesome. Woo! Patoo! No, Gargoyle. Uh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Uh, I see him shooting. Huh? Oh. He's turned into a bat! Boop! Take that, Harkin! Harkin! Stop it! Patoo! Harkin! Okay. You know what? Ariel's bow is nice and all, but I think I'm gonna go resort to good old lefty and righty. Uh, let's go ahead and go. Sit Puta! Puta! Yeah! Oh wait, I have I have something in my right hand. <laughs> Gosh damn it! Here we go! Alright, come here, Harkin! I'll rip you apart with my own p yeah, my own claws. I was gonna say bare hands, but they're more of claws. Arkin, get down here! Huh? Yeah, that's right. How do you like getting burnt? Ah, he moved. You can't you can't stay away from me forever. Pucha! Oh, you want you want your little blood pool? No, I'm gonna guard it. Where'd it go? Arkin, stop! Stop! You're making this a really crappy boss fight. Come on, stop running. Just take your punishment. Ha! Ah! Like Son of a... Oh, did he summon something else? Ooh. What is this? Oh, he revived the gargoyle. Stupid gargoyle! Pa -pa! Come on, Harkin. Oh, the bow? But, but, but claws! <sighs> Fine. Whoop! Pachoo! 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 Arkin, you're, you're making this too easy. Boop! Where'd he go? 
Aha! <laughs> okay, search Harkin. He got... Hmm. Ooh, Harkin's sword. Ooh! <laughs> that is awesome. I want that sword. I might actually use some swords here and there. Uh, okay, well, let's just take all that. Lord Harkin is no more. Well, so now what? Now that's done. What will you do now? Hmm? I'm not sure. I'll probably stay here for as long as they'll let me. I think we can rebuild here. Make my family's legacy something more respectable. Of course, if you've got any more adventures planned. Mm, I mean, she, her little fetishes are a little weird, but it's not like it was terrible having her along. Uh, okay, Zershin would love to have you come along, Serena. That's what I wanted to hear. Um, Velifair was saying something about vampire blood in the bow. It sounds like... That's the last bit of the prophecy. The blood of a daughter of Cold Harbor can corrupt the bow. Hmm. Can Zeshin use your blood, sure. then? Do you have any arrows, though? They would have to be of elven quality, I guess. Hmm. Zeshin's not gonna take your boats or any only fitness. Zeshin would like to treat some arrows I think with your need blood. To find some arrows first. Oh. Oh. Interesting. So apparently, if I just have some elven arrows, I could taint them rather than making them do the initial effect, which uh, you know, Lord kills Harkin them dead. defeated. Yep. I never imagined I'd see the day. Yep. My lady, you have my deepest sympathies. I am sure this was not easy for you. <laughs> he was out of control, Garen. It had to be done. I'm not happy about this. <sighs> he was still my father. That helmet. <laughs> <laughs> that helmet and that armor. Just the end of, something else. of course, my dear. All will be well now. Boop. Uh, do you I have any... the petty squabbles here. I have lived for far too long to be bothered with them. Okay. Uh... So, I guess that ends this campaign, because there's nothing else, is there? Return to your roots. Yeah, hmm. Well, I think one thing I do want to try is I want to... Shut up. Time. I want to try tainting one of the arrows and seeing if that does something. So, I'm going to go ahead and jump to one of the... Um, uh, places, I guess. Do you guys Lord sell Kitty, things? Good to see a new face here, especially one that isn't between you and me. <laughs> Just want my advice? No. Avoid getting wrapped up in Vin Galmo's schemes. He's after Harkin the throne, and he'll kill anyone that gets in his way. In his lust for power. How am I gonna get some elven arrows? All right, I will see you guys in a bit. I'm gonna see if I can find some elven arrows. Ah, finally, found some elven arrows. Just gonna buy these up from you. We're gonna go ahead and corrupt some and see how they Thank look. Thank you very much for your business. Okay, minion, I want you to treat some arrows with Let's your blood. Let's just get this over with. Blood curse elven arrows. Let's just get this over with. All right, I'm just gonna turn all Let's these just into get those. This over with. I think you'll need to find some arrows first. Only Elvin wants okay. to work for this, remember? Right. So now let's take a look at what these blood uh, cursed arrows do. Blood cursed Elvin arrows. Shrouds the sun in darkness if shot with Ariel's bow. Huh. So if I just. Boo! Oh. Well then. Ain't that interesting. 
So, I wonder if this is a permanent effect or not. Don't like those eyes you got. There's a bad hunger to them. Kashit guards to sell. Speaking of this. Okay. It's back to work then. So, did I just complete the prophecy? What do you think of this? Wait, is she mad at me? No, I, I, I can't tell. Nope. Okay, well, there we go. I guess I completed the prophecy. Now I don't have to worry about the freaking sun. What happened to the sky? But the question is, how long does this last? Is this permanent? I wouldn't mind if it's permanent. That would be pretty awesome. Dragons weren't enough. Now hmm. we've lost the sun too. Yep. What do you think of it? Well met, traveler. What brings you to White Run? I'd be a lot warmer and a lot happier with a belly full of mead. Yeah, yeah, so would I. Okay, well, let's go ahead and head back to the castle, see if they have anything to say. <laughs> I have so many of those arrows, too. This could be the start of a beautiful adventure. Vampire's hunger as you grow. Or <laughs> grow as you hunger. Uh, well, there's not really much of a sun out here. I'm just gonna fire another one just in case. Let's see. Woo! Nada. Uh, pfft, maybe now it's just permanent. So it's like. It, I. Um, I'm like trying to think, why do we have to kill her father? Obviously, she's fine. So we didn't have to kill her. So it's not like we're setting these up for this. I know she didn't want this to happen. Happen anyways, because I did it. So you killed your father for no reason. Don't get in my way, and I won't tell your arms off. Simple. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, hello, Grummer. Ready for some bloodshed beast? Bark! Let's state our hunger together. Nope. Okay. I don't know what that means. Wait, does that mean they'll, like, follow you? Let us hunger together, yes? You can't trust a word that comes out Ooh. of Vincalvo's mouth. Remember that. Where's the last batch of alchemy ingredients? I huh? What's going on? Ah, uh, yes, that there were, well, complications. I don't want to hear about it. I want what I ask. <laughs> we have a resident alchemist? Yes, Baron, oh, that's course. awesome. I'll see to it. Why, why do you put a rib cage inside here? That's weird. That's really weird. Okay, well, guys, I'm going to have to call it here. Now... What I was planning on doing is I wanted to play this up until the um, chapter ends. So what I'm planning on doing is I'm going to go back. I'm going to reorganize my whole Skyrim playthrough into seasons. So this will essentially be season one. And this is going to be the end of season one. But don't fret. I do plan to play more Skyrim in the future. Uh, the thing is I really want to change it up and whatnot because I'm getting a little bit tired of Skyrim a little bit. Not that it's not fun. But I want to do something different. So what I'm planning on doing is I want to try picking up something like Fallout for a bit. And then maybe uh, after I hit like a certain point, switch back to Skyrim and then kind of go like it back and forth. However, if you guys know of any other kind of adventure game where, you know, we can cut this up and switch between, uh, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, also, thoughts Life about Skyrim? Has many advantages. Don't interrupt me again, you cur. <laughs> but yeah, um, I think before I cut, I want to do one more thing. I've noticed my powers have grown, and I now have Ariel's bow with tainted arrows. So, what I want to do is I want to pop over to one of those war zones. We're going to give these idiots the what for. Alright, where was that one more zone? 
here we go. This place. We were here before. We got our butts kicked. But this time, I think it's time to lay down the law. The new law. The vampire's law. I am now blood starved. Who's there? Oh, look at that. Okay, well I don't need Ariel's bow right now, but that's fine. That's you! That's Get it. down! Son of a... And there's a giant! Well, giant! Potato! Stupid giant! You're dead! And you die! You die! Stop it with your blocking! Pucha! Haha! <laughs> and we have a dragon! You're not going to get the best of me this time! Wait, there's more things over here. Pachoo! Oh, is that a Dawn Guard? No, that's a White Run Guard. Hi! Dawn Guard! Boop! Boop! Oh! Well then! <laughs> uh. <sighs> well, that didn't go as well as I planned, but uh, it was kind of fun. Just a little test of powers. Anyways, guys, so th yeah, this will be the end of Season 2 of Skyrim. Uh, if you guys like this, leave a like. It always helps out a lot. And also, don't forget to, you know, if you, um, actually I should say, Shut up, Serena! I'm talking! <laughs> so, um, if you guys are new to the channel and you like to see more stuff, uh, leave a sub. Um, and uh, you'll see more things in the future and things like that. Um... And also, let me know if you guys are interested in seeing a Fallout, um, um, a Fallout series. I could do Fallout 3 or Fallout New Vegas, and I have ideas for both, and I would love to do it modded, just heavily modded, just pure, like, completely different. So I plan to, like, toss and, you know, manipulate that and see how that goes. Anyways, guys, this has been Zession of Heroes and Fools, and I'll see you all next time. Take care, and goodbye.